practical geometry introduction we use compass ruler and protractor we construct and measure different figures the ruler is used for measuring lines a compass for constructing protractor measures angles and the divider is used to make equal line segments or mark points on a line line segment let a and b be two points on paper then the straight path from a to b is called a line segment ab denoted by ab bar the distance between the points a and b is called the length of ab thus a line segment has a definite length which can be measured construction of a line segment we can construct a line segment of given length in two ways one by using ruler two by using compass construction of a line segment one by using ruler in this place the ruler on paper and hold it firmly Mark a point with a sharp edged pencil against at 0 cm mark of the ruler and mark another point at given value and join the points then we get the required line segment two by using compass draw a line l mark a point a on the line l place the metal pointer of the compass on the zero mark of the ruler open the compass so that the pencil touches the given value on the ruler place the pointer on a on the line l and draw an arc to cut the line mark the point where the arc cut the line as b on the line l we got the line segment ab of required length construction of a circle we use the following steps to construct a circle 1 open the compass for required radius 2 mark a point with sharp pencil this is center o 3 place the pointer of the compass firmly at o 4 without moving its metal point slowly rotate the pencil till it comes back to starting point perpendiculars two lines are said to be perpendicular if they intersect such that the angles formed between them are right angles perpendicular through a point on a given line Take a tracing paper and draw a line L on it. Mark a point P lying on this line. Now, we want to draw a perpendicular on L through P. We simply fold the paper at point P such that the lines on both sides of the fold overlap each other. When we unfold it, we find that the seed is perpendicular to L. perpendicular to a line through a point which is not on it draw a line l and a point a on it with a as center draw an arc which intersects the given line l at two points m and n using the same radius and with m and n as centers construct two arcs that intersect at a point say b on the other side of the line join a and b ab is perpendicular of the given line l
Construction of Angles Using Protractor Let us construct angle PQR is equal to 40 degrees. First, draw a ray QR of any length. Place the center point of the protractor at Q and the line aligned with the line segment QR. Mark a point P at 40 degrees. Join QP. Angle RPQ is the required angle. Constructing a copy of an angle of unknown measure. Let angle A is given whose measure is not known. First, draw a line L and choose a point P on it. Now, place the compass at A and draw an arc to cut the rays AC and AB. Use the same compass settings to draw an arc with P as center, cutting L and Q. Set your compass with line segment BC as the radius. Place the compass pointer at Q and draw an arc to cut the existing arc at R. Join PR. This gives us angle RPQ. It has the same measure as angle CAB. This means angle QPR has the same measure angle BAC. Constructing angles of special measure. There are some elegant and accurate methods to construct some angles of special sizes which do not require the use of the protractor. Construction of 60 degrees angle. Draw a line L and mark a point O on it. Place the pointer of the compass at O and Draw an arc of convenient radius which cuts the line L at a point say A. With the pointer at A and the same radius as in the step 2, now draw an arc that passes through O. Let the two arcs intersect at B. Join OB. We get angle BOA whose measure is 60 degrees. Note, similarly, we can draw 30 degrees, 45 degrees, 90 degrees, 120 degrees and 135 degree angles. My video can come in a channel like this, like change, share change. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.